Contestant number four, W. Joseph Stegner. Now what? Now what? W. Joseph Stegner. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. Now what? Now I get to say thanks to all of you. Now I get to tell you how much you mean to me and how powerful you've been to my life. Five years ago, when I was here, I had just been shot for interrupting a robbery. And I have survived to live a glorious five years. But I have to tell you that it is because I am a Toastmaster that my life has had so much meaning to me, I have to say. So to have a chance to suddenly have your attention, to be on this stage, and even though I had a bullet go through my pelvis and one through my side, I can still do that. And that's pretty cool. And when I was on that bus, and I had those bullet wounds, and I was holding my open scalp down to the skull, and I was looking down, my blood was dripping down on an agenda of an Andesha Toastmasters meeting <laughs> where I had been official timer and ballot counter earlier that morning. Another page was my poetry, so I thought, well, they'll know I was a poet, they'll know I was a public speaker, it's all good. And I wasn't afraid, and I actually felt peace inside. And it's because of the people I know, like Tevis Thompson. When I first became a Toastmaster, he wrote a written evaluation that I cherished for years. It gave me confidence, it gave me a feeling that if I speak, someone's going to listen. So you have all empowered me in ways that I'm just glad to be here. And if I could have given any topic, what now? That's the perfect introduction. What now? Thank you. It's my chance to thank you and tell you how important you all are to me. Albert Moe, his, his speech, are you a sparkle generator or a sparkle terminator? I have used those words. How many of you have quoted him? Raise your hand if you have quoted Albert. I certainly have, and not infrequently either, because those are powerful words. And when you're around people who are in their community who want to be lights of their community, you tend to get people who really care. And those are the best people to be around. And if anybody could be anywhere in the world, why wouldn't they be here? Did you see what it was like out there? Phenomenal, fantastic, marvelous. This is a beautiful place, and you are beautiful people. So what now? I'm going to walk out of here smiling and walk off this stage knowing that I'm glad to be here, and I love all of you. Thank you.